amateur footage has emerged of what's thought to be recent events in Dera. Well, let's talk now to Mahmoud, who is a political scientist based here in the UK, who has family in the city of Dara. Can I just ask you, uh, what have your relatives been saying to you? Well, uh, I managed to speak to four indiv individuals, including uh, uh, some of my relatives. Uh, the situation is, is really bad. There's no electricity, no water, and uh, as of now, there's no communication whatsoever. There's a curfew. Basically, anyone who dares to leave his house uh, is, is shot by, by live, live uh, ammunition. Um, the situation is worsened because uh, some uh, uh, p uh, people from other uh, neighboring villages are trying to make their way to ease the siege on, uh, on Dara. Uh, but they've been intercepted by, by security uh, police officers and, and, and uh, uh, Mukhabarat officers. Uh, uh, so the, the, this is the reported death actually came um, from, from those demonstrators trying to reach the old city of Dara. I cannot tell you who I have spoken to exactly because they, they, they are at risk of being arrested and, and possibly killed. But what I can say now, is that there's a total uh, lack of, of security. Uh, people in plain clothes uh, uh, belonging to the regime, they're opening fire in, indiscriminately at, at civilians and trying to suppress this peaceful call for, for freedom, for, for rights, for, for their basic rights as, as citizens of this country.